Okay, all right. All right. A large motor in a factory causes the floor to vibrate at frequency 10 Hz. The amplitude of the floor's motion near the motor is about 3 mm. Estimate the maximum acceleration of the floor near the motor. Okay, so question given you the frequency okay, and the amplitude. Okay, amplitude is actually the maximum uh, displacement. Okay, it is the maximum displacement. Amplitude. Alright, uh, but it is in millimeter. Uh, so you have to convert to cent, uh, meter SI unit. Alright. Estimate the maximum acceleration. So this one needs the maximum uh, acceleration. Okay. Maximum acceleration of the floor near the motor. Okay. So uh, what is the formula for maximum acceleration? You have learned. Uh, so based on this formula uh, that we derived before, acceleration is negative a omega square sine omega t. Okay, so the front part here, a omega square, is the maximum acceleration. Yeah. So if uh, for displacement, maximum is m a amplitude. You see, uh, if displacement maximum is amplitude, velocity maximum is a omega, and maximum acceleration is a omega square. Uh, see, a, a omega, a omega square, uh, x max, v max, and a max. So we, we're going to use this a max equal to a omega square. Okay, a max equal to a omega square. So, okay, so the, the answer is a max, maximum acceleration is equal to uh, a omega square. Uh, however, we don't have omega, uh, but we do know omega is uh, 2 pi f. Uh, omega is 2 pi f so uh, we have the frequency uh, so we just uh, substitute inside uh, find the omega first okay frequency is 10 hertz so we have uh, 20 pi uh, radian per second ah so we have 20 pi okay what is this okay so now um Okay, but amplitude, uh, this is the amplitude, okay, uh, amplitude is uh, 3 millimeter. so 3, uh, remember is, uh, you need to convert to SI unit, milli is negative, exponent negative 3, okay, uh, exponent negative 3, uh, so now we can substitute all into the A, uh, A max, which is uh, this one, okay, um and then omega is 20 pi okay and then uh, let's calculate okay so the answer is uh 11 point uh 84 uh meter per second square uh okay so if you look at the the answer it has a negative sign but actually uh this one asks for maximum acceleration uh, this one asks for maximum acceleration so uh, so it is not acceleration at certain time uh, so this one more to refer to only the magnitude uh, yeah it more refer to the magnitude so we only need the magnitude yeah so actually the negative sign is not needed here uh, the negative sign is not needed here because we are not talking about uh, acceleration at any time let me write it down ah uh, you see if uh, this one maximum acceleration, uh, just want to know the magnitude of the maximum value. Yeah, just want to know the magnitude of the maximum value. So the direction is not needed. Yeah. So we can say, uh, we can say over here, uh, direction. Uh, this one direction. Uh, not needed. Okay. Uh, but if the question asks for acceleration at certain time. Ah, then this one direction direction uh, needed okay we need to consider the direction uh, so we need to consider all the positive and negative value uh, okay direction acceleration at certain time uh, so is the direction to the right or to the left 
uh, then we need to put the positive or negative sign. But this question is about maximum acceleration, the maximum magnitude or maximum value of acceleration. So direction is not important here. Yeah, it's more to magnitude. So you can leave the answer with positive value for maximum acceleration. Okay, so that's all for this question.